Good morning, hello, happy Saturday. We are back on Saturday again. I hope you're well. Give me a big wave if you're about and getting ready to go. Drop your little one's names in comments so I can say hello. So, brilliant. Let's see who we've got on this morning. Oh, nobody's brave enough to be the first hello. Who's the first hello? Brilliant. Hi. Good morning, Sophie. Hello, you got the first hello. Hello, good morning, Theo. Good morning, Aubrey. Oh, everybody's up early this morning. Good on you, Zoe. Good morning. Good morning, Charlotte and Georgia. Good morning, Grace and Lucas. Good morning, Sarah. I hope you're all enjoying your props at home. Good morning, Maeve and Daddy. Good morning, Amy and Henry. Hi, Mummy. Hi, Isaac. Hello, Lex. Good morning. I hope you're enjoying your tambourine. Are you going to play it this morning? I've got mine ready too. Brilliant. So we're going to get ready. We're going to make we start in a minute. If you have your mice, your snail, your birds and your instruments and teddy handy. We've got lots on the list today. Um, we've got lots of songs to get through. So we'll have lots of fun. All right. So you still have a bit of time to grab those if you want. And then we'll make a wee start in a minute. So I hope you're all keeping well. Um, yeah. So we're back for another Saturday and we're gonna have lots of fun. So let's give it another wee minute, see if anybody else pops on and then we'll get ready to go. All right. So has anybody any news? Tell me anything in the comments. It's not as exciting. I don't get to talk to anybody in class these days. It's so sad. Really miss it. Um, getting all the news. Um, but yeah, silly me on Thursday forgot to do the hello song. Did anyone else know it? Give me a thumbs up if you know it is. At the end I was like, hmm, I don't think I sang it. I can't remember singing it. But sometimes you do these things on autopilot. And my husband Kenny came downstairs and he goes, Forget about the hello song. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I was so excited to get started um, that I just went on ahead with the rest of it. I forgot about the hello song. Good morning, Daisy and Hannah. Good morning. Welcome here. Good morning, Evan and Carrie. Good morning. Brilliant. So let's make a wee start. We're going to start with the hello song. So let's make a wee start. Let me see your weeping hands, your clapping hands and your lovely big smiles. Off we go. Hello, hello, music bugs all wave hello, smiling, waving, wave hello, wave hello. to be out and see loads of our mummy and daddy bugs and also some of our little bugs as well whenever I was out doing deliveries this week. It was so lovely for anybody who's new to put faces to names um, and also for anybody who I haven't seen in a long, long time. It was so lovely to see you um, and get a chance to chat very briefly um, and check that you're all doing okay. So, um, thank you so much for supporting me and getting that merchandise. There is another order going in, so keep a wee eye out. There'll be a post um, in the group about it. Um, keep a wee eye out and we'll get um, another post so that you can get what you want um, as well. That'll not be fastest finger first this time, so you're safe that time. Now, grab those instruments and we're going to sing Nelly the Elephant, okay? So grab them and off we go. What am I going to play today? Let's go with... Well, my problem is I have too much choice. Let's go with some bells to start with. Oh, my egg shaker. Lovely salt shakers. And my maraca keto. Off we go. <laughs> oh, bless. He saw this too, isn't he? He was right, you're right. Trump, trump, trump. 
So you can go and grab some wooden sticks. I've got my clays here, I might tap my clays. Then we're gonna scrape our instruments. So you can do that in any way, just a different sound. Then we're gonna play it slow. Then we're gonna play it fast. And then we're gonna march, okay? So we're gonna finish with marching. So let's go. to the side. Well done! Yay! Now, if you have a little one, pop them up on your knee or grab a teddy if they're a little bit older. And we're going to do bounce two, three, four. Bounce two, three, four. Up we go. Up we go. So let me show you how that will be. And to be honest, they're never really too old to sit on your knee unless they don't want to. Normally in class, I have two or three down my legs and I'm trying to bounce them up and down my legs. So this is bounce two, three, four, bounce two, three, four, up we go, up we go, have a little tickle, have a little tickle, 
wave hello, wave hello. All right, then we're gonna nod, we're gonna wiggle, we're gonna tap so you can tap their knees or tap their head and tap out to you. And then we're gonna beep, beep that nose or they can beep your nose, beep, beep, beep. All right, all about that coordination um, and doing a lot of contact as well. So off we go, I'll sit up here so you can see me better. my snail and we're going to do a little song called slowly slowly so pop them on your fingers if you have them or hold them in your hand your pictures and if you have a little one um, and you want to pop them down on the ground um, on a mat or something that's fine slowly with the snail we're going to go nice and slowly up and down their body and then quickly with the little mice with their little tickles, okay? Um, that's all about the sensory touch receptors. That's our strongest receptor whenever they're um, under a year old. That's the, the one that they have the most of. So they love that touch, baby massage, that kind of thing. Boys and girls, you're gonna join me. We're gonna get our little snail and if we can walk them along a surface, I'm gonna use my arm so you can see. We could walk them along a table and we're gonna go as, or along this floor as slowly as we can, all right? Or you could lie on the floor and pretend to be a snail, really, really slowly moving forward. Then we're gonna be a little mouse and our little mouse moves really quickly and gives lots of tickles. All right, quickly, quickly, little mice goes a little mice quickly, quickly, all about the house and it gives lots of tickles. Are we ready? Let's go. Slowly, slowly, very slowly goes the garden sail. Slowly, slowly, very slowly on the wooden frame. Now you hear the quickly, 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 very quickly, runs a little mouse. <laughs> Very quickly, all about the house. Get ready with your snail again. We're going to go nice and slowly. Off we go. Slowly, slowly. Quickly, very quickly, runs a little mouse. Quickly, quickly, very quickly, all about the house. 
we are back on Monday and we're off to the farm. So we're gonna go on a farm trip and if you could, if you could bring your instruments and if you have a horse, a duck, a sheep, a pig and a cow, if you have any of those toys or teddy soft toys, um, little figurines, anything at all, get your farm animals at the ready and we're gonna to go to Old MacDonald's farm. Okay, so that's back on Monday. Now we're going to do an action song. This one's called I Can Clap My Hands. Can you clap them too? All right. Then we're going to clap hands one more time. Then we're going to jump up high. We're going to tiptoe. We're going to stamp our feet. We're going to tap our heels. So find them down at the back of your feet. We're going to snap our fingers or flick our fingers, whichever one you can do. And we're going to shout hello. Okay. If you have a little one, you can do all those actions with them. Whenever you um, are doing their fingers, just pull open their little closed fingers and it's as if you're removing the fluff. You probably could do two jobs at the one time there, taking away that fluff that they all get. Um, and the same with jumping up high, nice and gently. You can help them jump up high um, and lift them up in the air. Now, not too much, or you can face them into you so you get a lovely contact on as well. Um, lift them up nice and high and uh, yeah, not too high in case they've had too much breakfast, okay? So let's go, I can clap my hands. So if you have your birds, get them ready. I have got today, I've got lots of different birds in my pot, but I know that you all know that. But today I've got a blue tit and I've got a kingfisher. So, and I know some of you have little birds now in your house, which is very exciting. So grab your little birds. We're gonna get two little dicky birds sitting on a wall. One named Peter, the other named Paul. Then we're going to fly Peter away. Fly away, Peter. Fly away, Paul. Come back, Peter. And come back, Paul. Okay? Don't worry if you don't have birds. Use anything as long as you have two of them. Okay? One for each hand. Um, let them hold them. And you can help with the arms if they need a little bit of help. We'll do this one a couple of times so they get used to it. For little ones, pop them down on the floor. And you can do those actions and it's all about the taking away out of their sideline and bringing back, building up that suspense and also around that nine months 
um, period when they get a little bit of separation anxiety. It's just the mummy's going away, but she's always coming back as well. So always bringing things back once they're away. So off we go. This is two little dicky birds. Get them ready. Two little dicky birds sitting on a wall. One named Peter, the other named Paul. Fly away, Peter, fly away, Paul. Come back, Peter, come back, Paul. Two little dicky birds sitting on a wall. One named Peter, the other named Paul. Fly away, Peter, fly away, Paul. Come back, Peter, come back, Paul. Last time. Two little dicky birds sitting on a wall. One named Peter, the other named Paul. Fly away, Peter, fly away, Paul. Where are they? Come back, Peter, come back, Paul. Yay! Brilliant work! That was fantastic. I think I can hear somebody singing around here. Yeah, amazing. Well done. Now we're going to grab those instruments. One last time we're going to do the grand old Duke of York. And when he was up, he was up. When he was down, he was down. And when he was only halfway up, he was neither up nor down. Okay, so if you want to do it as an action song, you can. Or you can do it with your instruments. I'm going to do it with some instruments. Let me think here what I'm going to choose. Off we go. <laughs> love getting lots of actions in. So there doesn't seem to be any birthdays today but we are back again on Monday so we're off to the farm. Please bring with you your horses, your ducks, your sheep, your cows and your pigs if you have them and um, your instruments as well. All right so we'll do some instrument songs. Um, if you saw my post last night please join me tonight at half past eight. I have another little announcement to make. Um, I'm just talking about how we're going forward. So grab a drink of something or a coffee and come and join me for a wee chat. Pop your messages and comments and I'll do my best to answer any of those questions that you have. Um, and we'll just have a wee chat about how everybody is going. And um, if you haven't had a chance to donate, please do. That would be amazing. Um, the PayPal me link is paypal.me forward slash music bugs north down. And that all, all those donations will be closing at the end of June. And um, finally, we are back tomorrow for our Father's Day Zoom session. If you'd like to join, it's free. And you just use the book when link to book through. And um, if you have any questions, just send me a wee message. There are, I think, two or three spaces left. So um, don't leave it too long, but it would be lovely to have you join with us. That's at 11 o'clock. A lovely way to kickstart your Father's Day with your little ones. Um, and it's lots of action songs and lots of fun to get going together. All right. Oh, brilliant, Joe! Yay! Brilliant. Hello, Lottie. Hello, Will. Yes, please do. Please join anytime. And you can always catch up on um, YouTube as well if you haven't had a chance. So, lovely to see you all. Thank you so much for joining me. See you again on Monday. And we're going to sing goodbye. See you soon. Bye. <laughs>